YouTube, what's the deal, man? I ain't too happy to be on here today. Y'all probably like, what is going on with your head? I'm about to cut them. I'm about to go ahead and cut them off. They're too damaged, y'all. I did a lot with them. Too much with them, to be honest. Too much with them. You know what I'm saying? They thin. And, and uh, they're not just damaged because I, cause I just took them out the wigs. they just damaged because, long story short, I had somebody else uh, start my life journey in the beginning. And they never should have. I was just impatient. So if I was y'all, I would be patient with finding somebody to do your hair, be all in your head and stuff. So, yeah. I'm about to go ahead and cut them off. But don't unsubscribe yet. Don't unsubscribe yet. Because we still going to be up with the lock journey. I'm just about to cut them, let my hair grow for like a month. Which, I'm gonna keep all this, this new growth. So I'm gonna just cut them, pick my hair out, washing and stuff. And then we back on the lockdown. So, yeah, I just want to come and show y'all what, what's going on. Let me give y'all a quick 360. Some of them are still in the wigs, some of them are not. I know a lot of y'all gonna be disappointed, especially if y'all can, you know, for the wicks and stuff like that. But like I said, we still gonna be a lock page, you know what I'm saying? We still gonna be doing lock videos and stuff, but this is about to be better now. So now I got a little bit more content. I can actually show y'all this process and this journey that I'm about to take. And yeah, yeah, that's that. I ain't gonna lie, it's a Saturday. It's real gloomy outside too. I'm like, man, but I don't wanna keep going through this. And the problem is, my hair be waked up. But then, like, a week or two later, it'll start getting loose in between the wicks. So, like, let's say if all this is wicked up, right? It'll start getting loose like this. Because it's not all the way, you know what I'm saying, combined and wicked up. So... The more you just keep on crocheting and trying to get it to stay wicked up, man, it's just doing damage to your hair. So this is my opinion. If I was y'all, I would not get your hair wicked by the crochet method unless the person really know what they're doing and been doing it for years and he won't have to keep white touching it up with the crochet. Y'all, I'm not too sad anyway. My hair is supposed to be down here. Just because, uh, well that's where it was at before. I even got them wicked up. But yeah, I see like it's a lot going on over here. Hopefully y'all can see this. You feel me? This is a lock that broke a long time ago. So yeah. I really don't. I really didn't even want to make this video, I just wanted to cut it, but I'm like, nah, it'd be unfair to them if I just went ahead and cut it and not showed them nothing and told them nothing and nothing, shit like that. So, yeah, I guess we about to start snipping. And I'm gonna bring y'all back in when it's a fro. And yeah, we about to start this journey all over. But hey, y'all, it's just hair, it'll grow back. It's, it'll grow back for sure. So, all right, y'all, stay tuned. I'm not too happy about this, but it is what it is. Boom. <laughs> Alright, what's the deal, YouTube? Alright, so, um, man, as y'all can see, I cut it off. Didn't want to. Um, it was just real damage. 
you know, uh, I got them in here. You feel me? So, hold on before you click off the video and unsubscribe. I plan on getting them back, but this time I'm gonna just um, get wigs instead. Instead of just uh, getting my red, red locks back. So, some of them are still combined at the root. And I don't know if y'all can see, but how skinny they are at the root right there. So that's why I cut them. Um, not all of them was like that. Y'all can see this one was real thick. It was combined and everything. Um, but see right here, let me put this down. Right there, how skinny it is. You might not think it's skinny, but it's too skinny for my liking. So yeah, I got all of them right here, man. Not gonna lie, it was kind of painful cutting them off. I see, like, part of it broke and ripped off and some other stuff. But, um, as y'all can see, I got a nice size little fro. Um, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, I'm gonna grow it back out, you feel me? Give me like, let me give you a little length check real quick. So, one second. So this is what we're working with right here. So it ain't too short, but it ain't all that long either. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring you on this journey with me like I do everything else. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just start the wigs. Um, basically just with the rubber band, you know, section them off how I want them, put the rubber band on them, and go ahead and let them lock up like that. I'm not gonna get them crocheted this time. I'm kinda against that crochet uh, method. I mean, if you know what you're doing, then I salute you, but as far as me, um, I don't really wanna deal with that crochet method no more. Cause even if you know what you're doing, technically you still pulling hair into, it. it's a whole little process, and I'm really not trying to do that. So this time I'm gonna bring y'all on the wick journey. Instead, I mean it still locks, but I'm gonna uh, it'll just be wicks this time instead of you know the regular locks. So you know, hopefully y'all find that interesting as well, and y'all stay subscribed and everything. But um, I plan on shaving the sides and the back again. I don't know if y'all can tell, but it's kind of growing in down here. I'm gonna shave that. Go ahead and put my uh, my parts in or however I want my wigs. And yeah, that's how we're gonna do that. We're gonna go ahead and just start this wig journey. I'm I'm, I'm very excited because uh, I really love the wigs, you feel me? So I'm ready to see the transformation. And like I said, y'all gonna be able to see the whole transformation because I'm gonna uh, bring you on this journey with me as well. So right now, I just, um, my hair was kind of matted down because I still sleep with like my uh, dread sock or dread cap, whatever you want to call it. So I'm just about to put some product in my hair right now. Kind of style it, you feel me? Because don't get me wrong, I really don't care too much for the actual fro look. Especially when it's kind of small like this. So I previously just sprayed some water in my hair. Um, I do wet my hair every night in the shower. I don't technically wash it, but I do wet it. So, um, I'm about to put this product in there and uh, show y'all what it's looking like. I ain't gonna lie, when I first cut my locks, I felt a little relief because uh, the, the locks wasn't too long and they wasn't too heavy, but of course it's still weight. So yeah, my head feels so much lighter. Um, kind of slept a little better just because you know I'm not laying on them and stuff like that so uh, yeah I ain't gonna lie I, I kind of did enjoy um, after the fact of cutting them off and I was even debating on if I wanted to get some waves don't judge me don't judge me I know a lot of y'all still be trying to decide which I want to do eventually if y'all ever thinking about cutting your locks but like I said this ain't a a permanent cutoff. You feel me? Look, look how much hair we got. 
And after I cut my locks off, this is just all the new growth that was there and stuff like that. So, um, this is probably like a week after I cut my locks off. So, yeah, man. I kind of miss just having regular hair, too. Lil' Key was going to ask my girl to give me some, um, some braids just to help my hair continue to grow until I get to the length of where I want it to be. When I wake it up, I'm probably just about to go with the little nappy fro look real quick. I ain't got a sponge, but you can still do it with your hand. This is how we about to rock out for a few weeks. I'll probably uh, get the wicks in like a month. I should have, you know what I'm saying, some more hair by the end. Yeah, Cause like I said, the fro ain't too small, but it ain't too big either. But yeah, I just wanted to bring y'all in show y'all everything that's going on let y'all know what we got planned for the future so like i said i hope y'all stay subscribed and um y'all interested about this wig journey because i know i am but i just want to thank all my supporters and everybody who comment and let me know y'all rocking with me i really fuck with y'all and i appreciate it you feel me especially times where i be feeling like i really don't be knowing if i want to keep doing youtube or if I want to do different content, but y'all comment and let me know, you know what I'm saying? Keep rocking out with the lock videos. Cause y'all be y'all really appreciate it and shit. So I fucks with y'all. And I appreciate it. And uh yeah, so this is another journey that we about to go on. I hope y'all prepared. And uh that's it. So um I'll probably make another video within like a week to let y'all know the the growth check. So yeah, I'm gonna be continuously making lock videos. Well, not lock videos, but like videos, you know, showing y'all the growth of the hair. And then when I finally do get it whipped up, y'all most definitely gonna find out about that. So I just wanna say that. Um, it's your boy E for real. Stay up, stay locked, even though I'm not locked right now, but I'm still locked in with the locks. And uh, stay safe. Love y'all. I'm out.